Over half the states of the European Union now criminalise Holocaust denial, uh, which is important because it sends out a message. And generally, um, you see very little Holocaust denial produced or promoted by European groups, even neo-Nazi groups. As from November 2010, all European Union states will have had to criminalise Holocaust denial as a result of the Common Framework decision which the Par European Parliament passed last year. Again, it's important because some states don't have legislation, they don't have hate crime legislation, uh, but by passing this legislation uh, it sends a very important message uh, that you cannot um, tamper with history, uh, that you can't promote hate, uh, and uh, it, it has in fact led to a real reduction in Holocaust denial. What we can't deal with at the moment, although there are United Nations resolutions, uh, is Holocaust denial that's being promoted by uh, Arab states and by Iran. Uh, and we still see that seeping in, so we still have to find ways to confront that. Uh, but because of the education programs, um, I think they're probably not having that much success, at least in Europe.